What is up, Wolfpack? My name is the Damage Gamer, and today I have a vehicle guide for you. This is from Star Wars Battlefront 3. It's gameplay from the beta, and uh, I know you guys will enjoy it because it's a really good game. I went 40 and 7, which is pretty nice, uh, which is even more than a 4 KD, which is really good. And um, in this game, you're gonna see perfect use from many vehicles. And um, I fast forwarded a little bit, uh, just a little while ago, because. It takes a little while for the vehicles to get into combat because they kind of spawn outside and then you have to run in. So you'll see um, gameplay from the ATST, uh, the ATAT, the DF9 turrets. You'll see gameplay from. You'll actually see really good sniper gameplay and DH17 gameplay, which is the gun I believe I'm using, um, which I, um, my friend also hit a quad with, which was the very first. Uh, DH-17 quad that has ever been recorded, so it's technically a world record, which is pretty epic. And, uh, yeah, so, this is kind of like a vehicle guide. You'll see use of the anti-infantry turrets, anti-vehicle turrets, all this stuff. It's pretty awesome, and I, rec I recommend you guys download the game. Today is the d last day of the beta, so, um, I recommend that if you do download it, then you start ripping it hard. So, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. I trimmed it down a lot by, uh, putting it in times 8 speed. Um, because, or else it would be like 25 minutes long, which, because, uh, these games are 20v20, which is awesome, because there's a ton of guys to kill, right, so you can get a ton of kills, uh, and as you can see in that quad TV, if you watch it, there was a ton of guys there, and, um, yeah, it's just absolutely insane, the only two modes that are in the beta right now is a 20v20 mode and an 8v8 mode, um, I would prefer this one, because there are more enemies, and there are a lot of vehicles in the 8v8 mode, I don't think there are any vehicles, and it's more like um, kind of a hard point kind of thing because you have to capture each um, little zone. But it's kind of like capture the flag. Um, no, no, I mean domination in a way that you have to stand near it and like capture it. But it's also like hard point because it moves every once in a while. There's only one of them, so it's pretty cool. And I can't wait for the full game to come out because it's gonna have a lot more in it. So yeah, there's only two game modes to play, and which means there's two maps. But this map is pretty awesome, and the maps are huge, and it has great graphics for a beta, if you haven't noticed that already. So I hope you enjoy the rest of the video, and I hope you guys leave a like and comment down below, and subscribe to you in the Wolfpack today, and I'll see you guys later.
Activated in order to stop a Y-Wing attack. 